What's going on, people? It's the Xbox. 448 and today guys I want to talk about PUBG basically because everybody else is talking about PUBG I'm talking people on social media I'm talking other youtubers I'm talking people who are saying it's broken five frames per second all sorts of good stuff and I want to straighten a couple things out here now first of all I got to give a huge shout out to my boy Andy Mac who actually hooked me and O Snaps up with the code. We were able to play, uh, it was funny, we were able to play before midnight on release. So we were able to play early, we were streaming, and it was a lot of fun. And I, I have to say, uh, O Snaps is definitely addicted to this game. She absolutely loves PUBG. Now me, I, I like it. There's there's something to it. There There is, um, there is a fun factor to the game that is, I, I, Something you almost can't explain, man, because it's definitely not graphics and stuff like that. I mean, it, it looks good for what it is. Um, it reminds me kind of like uh, Grand Theft Auto in terms with graphics and stuff like that, which, you know, take it or leave it. But then again, a game isn't about graphics. But, you know, there's people out there on social media that are really trying to dog this game. And I got to say, guys, uh, whether you're just an Xbox hater, you're just kind of like jelly that when it comes to consoles it's on xbox guys this is a game preview game i have no idea why people are coming out well look at the frame rate look at this look at that oh they need to do this they do need to do a lot you know to this game before its official release date but until then um if you're buying this game you're buying a game preview product which means it's a game that is not finished yet um you know I, i'll let you know right now there is definite frame rate issues with this game uh as of right now it seems to have gotten uh, a bit better you know the first day it was really bad first day even the servers were loaded uh the frame rates were were in my opinion were horrible on the first day now it got better on the second day um, the first day I had trouble aiming at other characters, other people in the game, because it seemed like the, the frames got really choppy when, when we came together. Not so much now. Um, I, I hear even kind of like stupid complaints, in my opinion, very stupid complaints when it comes to the lobby, right? The lobby where all 100 people are in one area, and they're basically running around, they're punching each other, they're shooting each other. Of course, there's no damage, there's a crash plane there. And it, it's not meant for anything. It's just getting everybody together, you know, on the server before we get dropped onto the island. And people are actually complaining about that because the textures, uh, they'll either pop in late or, or possibly not at all. So you get like these real blurry textures in, in the lobby. Or whatnot but guys this is just a lobby on a game preview game like if you're gonna nitpick and complain about that stuff um man I, I don't know what to tell you I have no idea why you purchase or invested in a game preview game all in all if you look at it like I there's a couple games I've gotten in game preview on day one uh, we happy few was one of them and arc survival evolved was another one and I have to say, when it comes down to it, on the first couple days, PUBG actually runs better than those two games did on their first days, coming out on Game Preview. And um, I have a couple friends as well who bought a game called Elite Dangerous. Now, there is a, a very active community playing Elite Dangerous, and uh, when that game first started, that game was really, really rough in terms of performance and stuff like that and you know we didn't hear too much about that um but i'm guessing just because PUBG, you know it's sold it's sold like crazy on the pc uh it's coming over to xbox first and, and all, all sorts of good stuff that you're gonna have kind of like fanboys out there trying to uh you know fan the flames trying to really get some negativity rolling here but i gotta say when it's all said and done PUBG is running better than, like I said, Ark Survival Evolved, We Happy Few, and, and, and you know, what I heard from my friends on Xbox Live, Elite Dangerous. It's, it's performing better than those games did within their first couple days of game preview. So guys, when it comes down to it, if you have an interest in the game, if you want to help the game grow, if you want to, you know, 
let developer uh, Blue Hole, you know, know when the frame rates are dropping in your game. Uh, you know, hit up social media. I'm pretty sure there's there's forums as well. Uh, let them know what's going on with the game so you can take part in helping the game evolve and get better. Then, yo, go ahead and spend your $30 on this game. Now, if you want to play this game but you don't want to deal with all that then i have to tell you take that thirty dollars put it back in your wallet back in your bank account and wait um <laughs> i have a feeling it's going to take quite a, a a long time for this game to actually have an official release um if i had to do a prediction here i would say at least two years before it uh, officially releases um you know on the xbox and whatever other platforms they decide to do it on and if you want to wait that long, go ahead. But if you want to take part in the game, if you want your voice to be heard in terms of helping the game evolve, then um, take that $30, go to Xbox Live right now, and pick it up. It is a lot of fun. Uh, I'm not sure about the longevity of this game, but I can say as for right now, um, I am happy putting this game into my rotation of games that I play normally. And I'm having a lot of fun playing the game. But as usual, guys, you know, if you like the topic, you like the gameplay, definitely hit that thumbs up button for me. Hit the comment section. I want to know what you guys think, your experiences with PUBG, how you feel about the performance. And do you see what I'm saying here, guys? If, if you don't want to be a part of the development process, then maybe you should just wait. And you might be waiting two years. But as for now, this is the x -Bot 448. And I am definitely... Signing off. Well, we did it. Wish we had time to think of another way.